and welcome to my channel. Um, <laughs> today, <laughs> I am tackling my pots and pans cupboard. Um, I, and you know what? It doesn't feel like it's one cupboard. It's like there's some under the stove. There's like I have to get it organized. Um, I am going to just let you know. Um, the way our kitchen is set up, we can't really... This cupboard here on the very end is very hard to access. You can open it and then you kind of have to squeeze beside the fridge. Yeah. So that is originally where I had my pots and pans. But that wasn't working. So then I decided to move them under my sink. So where you would normally have like cleaning supplies and stuff like that. That is now where my pots and pans are. So before I show you what it looks like right now, <laughs> um, I want to explain the plan. So as you know, um, we hope to redo, we're going to be painting soon. Um, we've got a theme picked for the kitchen, which I'm really excited to show you. Um, but as for these horrible drawer or cabinets, we are going to get... Um, Dan's going to install the drawers that you can pull out. Um, oh, just looking at that gives me anxiety. Um, he's gonna get. In, we're gonna get a couple of those just to help manage it. Um, oh my gosh! So let me show you this horrible mess. All right, that is it. See, I've got baking dishes in there. There's a rolling pin in there. I don't I don't even want to know why that's in there. Um, there's I didn't even see that before. There's a watering can. I have no plants. I cannot keep them alive. Why do I have a watering can? These are the things you gotta ask yourself, right? Yeah. So there's probably going to be some purging, and that's not even it. There is some under, like in the drawer under the stove. Um, yeah. So yeah, it was <laughs> lovely. Um, so I'm going to figure this out, um, see if I can get some kind of system in place for now that will work until we can obviously upgrade it um now it is un it is under the sink it's Dan messaging me it is under the sink so I have the situation of a tap I'm sure you noticed that I'll show you here you'll see that tap goes right down so yeah um <laughs> what I'm thinking I might like to do is put like the small baking dishes there um, that seems logical. Um, and those sliding drawers can be very expensive. Um, we did find some that were reasonable and, you know, all we need is a big one and then, like, maybe even, like, a little narrow one. Um, yeah, so. But that's all in the future. For now, let's get this done. Now, my tripod broke. You know, I can't even call it that. This piece of plastic that I got temporarily at the dollar store um, has kind of broke. So I'm gonna hope it's going to stand up for me so you guys can watch it because otherwise this is pointless. So I'm gonna get you guys set up. I'm gonna get my butt on the floor and we're gonna get to work. Okay, um, that wasn't too bad. Now I just have to kind of make some hard decisions. Um, I don't even know if I can make hard decisions. Um, 
because I do, like, when I have Thanksgiving and stuff, like, family meals, it's good to have, like, two bigger pots and stuff. So I think I'm going to keep all of this. I'm going to put it back in in a reasonable order and then see if I can get my bacon stuff maybe in under the stove. Let's hope for that. It's done. It is not how I want it at all. I don't have enough space to make it the way I want it. But let me turn you around and show you. Alright. So, ignore that stuff, please. Um, I've got my big, big pot back there because I don't use it every day. I don't use it every week, right? It's just there. Um, my strainer and um, my favorite pan of all time which I use all the time. It's from Ikea. It is awesome. There's a little plug for Ikea. <laughs> um, we use these a lot as well, so keep those there. Um, these we don't use as often, so I just put them further back. And these we use, again, these are Ikea. I, awesome. Um, we use those fairly often. This obviously needs a good wash. Um, this was a soup pot my mom had gotten, and it comes in handy, so. And then back there, I didn't even take those out, but one of those is my mom's that she used every holiday, and it's in awesome shape, so I'm going to keep using it. Um, and then down below that, right there, is my grandfather's popcorn pot. Yeah. Um, he made the hands-down best popcorn um and when you make it in that it's just so amazing so yeah that's the cupboard for now so now i'm going to take a look under the stove and see if i can put some of these blast bakeware things in there well look at this how's that for a shocking surprise so i've got my cake pans i've got two bread pans, which is going to be awesome, my roasting pan, and I've got two muffin tins, and mini muffin tins, and that's it, and that's kind of freaking awesome, so, I'm just going to do a little bit of rearranging, and then I'll show you what it looks like when I'm done, there we go. So this is how it is just temporarily until we get what we need, but it's least, least manageable. So I just put my glass baking sheet here. This is like my brownie pan, um, cake pans, and then my bread pans, or loaf pans, and then all my um, muffin tins are under there. Over here, I've got my glassware there, which is not all of it, and then the um, roasting pan, the smaller roasting pan. And it does close. It's just heavier now. <laughs> so that's that done. And you guys, I think I'm going to do something super, super crazy after I wash that wall that I now see is extremely dirty. Is do this. This is craziness. I don't even know what I have in there. So we're going we're gonna to do it. We're going to go for it. Okay, so I'm pretty sure the tripod thing is officially broken. So unless some glue or majorly good tape comes in in my possession in the next little bit, I'm going to have to hold you by hand. Um, okay, so I just cleaned out this, this drawer. There's still a couple things I'm going to go over with you, but I'm going to turn you around so I can show you what I found so far. I have two bags of snack bags. I have two bags of sandwich bags, both opened. A foil, two things of saran wrap, wax paper. I honestly do not remember the last time I actually used wax paper. In fact, I believe this came from my grandmother, to my mom, to me. But am I going to get rid of it? Of course not. 
because I'm going to get rid of it, and then I'm going to do something that's going to call for wrapped paper. I have an entire thing of parchment paper I did not know I had. I had an empty saran wrap thing. Um, clearly is garbage. I found my dough thingy. And the cake knife that's filthy dirty that I have been looking for. Yeah. And then it gets better. Here's my electric knife, my immersion blender. Um, butter, potatoes, doodle, and box. Okay, I'll bite. This was just a letter. My mom would always leave me notes. Um, and I guess that's why I kept it. In this random envelope. Okay. So that needs to go somewhere else. Matches and my, my string. Look how dirty that is. Oh. I need to do some cleaning. I also found an entire bag of the um, wipes. Um, like the J-cloth type things. They're from the dollar store, but found those. And I found, well, I knew I had these because you just saw me do my stove. But I found another box. So I'm going to do some work and get combining stuff, and I will show you what the drawer looks like when I'm done. Okay, so it's done. So I kept my immersion blender and my, my electric knife here. I put, this is all I ended up left with the burner liner, so I've just got a few of the small ones left extra thing of snack bags in the back and then I've got my sandwich bags and snack bags here I just combine the two sandwich bags because really people are like why two things glad my parchment wax and foil are all there and this is my garbage pile these are really these are really really old um, and I do not like them um, now they have the Betty Crocker ones at the dollar store, so that's those are the ones I get. Um, so I'm throwing those out, and then there's only one left, and it's all it's all bent and shit in there. So I'm just gonna toss it because one is not going to help me. Um, and then I do normally keep my towels in here, so I'll just pull up those in there. Um, but that's it. So I, you actually got an extra drawer out of me today, so that's kind of exciting. <laughs> So, yay, extra drawer for you. Um, so I'm just going to throw this stuff out, tidy up, put some stuff in our... I've got the uh, watering can to go into um, my donate pile, we'll call it. And, uh, yeah, I think I'm done. I'm actually glad I got that done today. Um, I'll be even better, ha more happy when we have the drawers for in there so that they're easier to organize. Um, yeah, so that's it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. If you liked it, definitely give it a big thumbs up and subscribe if you're new. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.